ang pinagdasal natin kay Lord minsan ay mag-sweetheart na magpakailanman. Ladies and gentlemen, ang unang halik at unang yakap, Mr. and Mrs. J.R. and Abby Bobbies. Congratulations and God bless you. Mabuhay ang bagong kasal! In the first place, parang ang gusto ko lang talaga is yung makahanap ka ng katulad ni Jay na makakasama. Parang ano lang talaga ngayon, gift talaga na siya yung binigay sa akin ni Lord. <laughs> Nagkasama kami sa church, tapos parang we established uh, ministries together. So one ministry is from there we grew close, closer together. Actually, hindi crush eh. Parang, oh, oh, crush. <laughs> Crush nga. Pero nung niligawan niya na ako, so kinakabahan ako, tapos pinupush ko siya away hanggang sa doon sa time na nawala na yung ano ko, yung kaba ko. Tapos, yun na, naging ano na lahat natural. Si Abby is very discerning. Parang when she looks at people, parang she looks at their heart. So parang ang nakita ko sa kanya is someone I can really talk to. Dalawa, you will not be the same people after your vows. You will slowly turn to become a blessing, a miracle for each other, willing to do what God wants you to do. Abby, did you come here of your own free will to bind yourself forever in the love and service of your husband? Yes, Father. JR, did you come here of your own free will to bind yourself forever in the love and service of your wife? Yes, Father. I want to begin our journey by honoring and thanking you for loving me unconditionally. I always say that you make me see God's love. Wherever this journey may lead us, always remember that you will have a home in me. I love you. Oh, thank you. I love you. <laughs> Paano nga ba magdesisyon sa mga gagawin? Doon yung mararamdaman ang laman ng kaluluwa nyo. That's why, you know, if this person beside you is close to God, in your lifetime journey, never ever forget na ang inyong kaluluwa iisa na if it's united with them. And it's your praise will never be